at approximately 1.30 in the morning. The two suspects were taken into custody at 11 Bellevue in Detroit in a commercial vehicle. They were in an art studio within that uh, building that has multiple kinds of partitions, if you will, in that building. Uh, they were taken in custody, as I said, at about 1.30 in the morning. Our fugitive apprehension team uh, took custody and possession of them, and they were formally lodged in our jail where they remain at about uh, 0300, about 3 o'clock in the morning. So they are in our jail, um, all three of them, the son and both parents. They are segregated, each individually, in isolation. Uh, we have uh, advanced watch on them. There is no indicator that any of them, we always have every person that comes in an intake evaluated by counselors and classification to determine if there's any threats to themselves or anyone else. Uh, there was no indication that any of them were suicidal, but out of an abundance of caution, our amazing corrections team is doing suicide watches on all three of them. So uh, they are in custody and again in isolation. So uh, that's a good step. We believe they were assisted in that uh, location to get there, to get in. And uh, we're gathering that information and we're gonna have the totality of that done fairly soon uh, and present that to our prosecutor for potential charges for either uh, um, aiding and abetting or uh, obstruction of justice.